Hello people, what is going on? Welcome back to our channel. This is Serene and today I want to talk about a Turtle One, a vehicle that you can get from the Emerald boxes of the Shamrock event in World of Tanks. What is tank? This tank is a slow but steady tank that uh, can do damage if you play it correctly and if you have the patient, of course. Uh, limited to 30, 24 km an hour. This tank packs 3500 damage if you manage to equip it correctly and that is before you put the premium consumable, the bond rammer, the bond vents and everything. My equipment over here is rammer, hardening and uh, turbo just to you know make this tank uh, playable for every kind of city map. Um, I'm not using any rotation mechanism because this tank has 0 0.25 uh, dispersion when moving and turning the turret. Actually no, when you turn the turret is 0 0.1 which if you play this tank uh, with its arc, I mean the arc, the vehicle arc it's uh, alright. Um, I don't know the exact statistics of it but uh, as you can see it's really really manageable and uh, as you can see, the vehicle, the, the circle itself is not uh, blooming that much, so it's perfect without the rotation mechanism. I know we got 500 damage from the side, but oh boy, this is where this tank is gonna shine. Putting it full down, we don't have really have the grip to you know to go up this thing, but we managed to do finally. And over here we have 300 millimeters of armor. Yes, not even premium rounds of um, the tier eights are gonna go through us, so we can sit here comfortably. Um, I managed to overangle my uh, tummy of the tank and we ricochet that um, 703 and over here we are loading a goal. We tried to penetrate but we don't do that. We are going to load HE next and what tank can sit comfortably? This is the tank that Wargaming should market as, um, you know, as, um, you know, blocking damage and what they made with the carry. The carry is not a tank that blocks damage. This tank, look at it, is blocking HE rounds. I mean, the HE rounds with 225 meters of penetration and 800 managed to do uh, like 80 damage to us from the BZ and we are doing reliable 100 damage to the um, to the 703. So what does that mean? And once again, 140, there we go. We managed to block the carry premium round, 292 milliliters of penetration, and we are just farming over here. We block 3.1k damage, but we don't do really much damage, and you know, we are just holding the enemies. On top of that, this tank can do Alliance 12 as well, a rock solid. You can uh, block a lot of armor if the enemies don't know how to to penetrate you and you have a really small cupola and just at a 5.5 second reload that BZ is uh, down for and we're kind of running low on HE and we, once again we cannot climb this this thing. Um, come on, we need to aim that cupola, there we go, 0 0.35 accuracy, can do the job, uh, the, he's still searching for a weak point, come on, 80, come on, can we do 112 with the next damage? luckily no and uh, bro we are spotting with dealt 1.2k damage spotting and there we go another 90 so yeah, can, as you can see with the HE to the top of that we are having a 1200 dpm which is still really interesting comparing considering this uh, this tank's HE round has 54 millimeters of penetration and 430 alpha damage and this and on top of that the AP rounds are uh, 330 with 224 and APCR is 230 with 253 253 is not the best we managed to pick up the kill over there beautiful and no one is shooting the HE to that 703 I really want to push and do some more damage because for the moment 3.2k is not enough uh, combined we wait a second to connect the shell and uh, yeah, a big disappointment of this vehicle is the um, shell velocity is like 730 and you can really feel if you're gonna snipe that uh, the shells are gonna have an arc and even APCRs have it under 1000 meters a second. So uh, yeah, the ammunition of this vehicle is not the best but uh, you know after you play with it and you get the taste of it it's um, you know it's not it's not that bad anymore i mean the penetration itself for a tank destroyer it's not the best 253 is like even uh, lower than some heavy tanks and some medium tanks so uh, yeah you cannot really rely on it sometimes but obviously you have the armor so um, <laughs> that's all it matters you know 
this tank it's uh, more like a turtle i mean the tur the turtle is a tier 9 it's much better than this but this tank can still uh, do the same uh, the same uh, you know the same bouncing and uh, i don't know it feels like because it doesn't have any weak points on top is like only a small cupola over there this tank it's uh, bouncing more much more and uh, I don't really, I don't even know where that STRV is. It's like he's sitting somewhere in the middle, but I cannot really do that. And I'm really impressed by the rate of fire of this of the vehicle. What is he using? It's like seven seconds or even better. And uh, yeah, over there, as you can see, we blocked two eight eight meters of penetration with noise by just side scraping. So uh, yeah, this thing has special armor. I mean, in in an uh, tech tree variant in the AT fifteen, I think it's called. I think it's 8015 because you have like the um, armor it's worse you have a worse flat uh, um, structure you have the cupola that tank it's uh, much worse on top of that you have like a really good dpm on that vehicle like but you have 230 alpha damage and 73 millimeters of uh, caliber oh that's that's not good i mean this vehicle has 107 or 108 but it's still uh, not managing. It's not managing to overmatch anything. I mean, um, how to say? I cannot really say that the gun is the best, but you know, it's comfortable. It's uh, not broken, but it's good. So um, the tank itself is like eight out of ten, in my opinion. I mean, for players who like um, who like slow paced, slow steady paced and uh, you know taking your time to grind the to grind the position to grind your enemies as we did with the eight with the 703 uh this is the best tank for you but if you enjoy um, you know some um, some faster gameplay i think this tank is not perfect for there are better uh, so what we're gonna do now we are just gonna you know we want to do more damage but because we are too slow we are not gonna do any any okay, any kind of that we put one we bounce that uh we hit that we got punished and um come on can you finish this battle off we managed to do some spotting i tried to knock that thing over but we don't have the he so unfortunately we didn't manage to do we blind fire and one of those connected uh where is the strv there it is we managed to do one and that's it 3.3k damage and 1.5k assistance beautiful match and let's see what we managed to achieve in this battle and here is the result screen uh we did manage to do a blind shot worth of damage into the strut one s1 uh before we managed to put another round when he got spotted an insta kill 3.3k damage four kills i'll take that and also 1.5k uh, assistance that's actually a lot for this uh, for this map especially looks like we managed to spot the only for the artillery i don't know i don't know what happened but I was so focused in the game that I didn't even realize that I dealt uh, so much amount of spotting. And on top of the 5.2k blocked, yes. In the position that we were, we were 300 plus meters of armor, so nothing could uh, take us out. Unlike 8 rounds that we managed to spam to this 703. Uh, we got a cool headed, okay, and still well. And we also managed to complete, well, first, uh, first mission of be the top one by damage block. Yes, the turtle one can... Uh, do some bouncy bouncy missions and uh, in terms of uh, performance we managed to be second by the damage the t104 the t103 managed to be first by the damage he snook our um, our high caliber but we don't really care 1.4k base experience beautiful it was a okay match for a tortoise for a turtle sorry and we managed to make 165k profit in around six Oh no, it was a nine minute battle pretty much. And uh, what can I say? Let's take a look at the statistics of this uh, 84 battles. I, yes, I played the turtle a lot because I kind of like it. 54 percent win rate is not the best because obviously it's a slow tank and uh, 1020, it's all right. But look at this 1.9k in damage. We managed to do more damage than um, on average. It's like we dealt a tank and a half worth of damage, which is really, really nice. Considering this tank has uh, is so slow, and um, obviously if you're gonna if you're gonna have enemies for 30 seconds in front of you, you're gonna do all that damage. You don't need to worry that much because look at this 3.5k damage. This tank is eating its enemies if you have the chance to penetrate and hit them reliable. So this was the video pretty much. 
This was the Turtle Mark I, a vehicle that you can get from the Emerald boxes and uh, a vehicle that, uh, well, personally I bought it for 6 million credits in uh, the black market or the auctions or wherever I bought it, but this tank is alright. I mean, if you like uh, slow tank this rare, if you enjoy your turtle, uh, your, uh, what is called your uh, tortoise, the tier 9, this tank will do the same and uh, it does have the DPM to put, that's the most important. So without further ado, I'll end the video here. I will see legends in the next one. Bye bye.